want to harm your children. Think about that. Now we know this trip is full of people like that. And we the people will protect the children at all costs. you on your birthday just consider it our present to you gag me with a spoon drop it like it's hot come on man what are you doing what is wrong with you are you kidding me well it warms my heart that she's in jail you know you can't make this stuff up normal people don't shoot at the cops what are you thinking flash here's the cold hard facts what are you kidding me what the heck is wrong with you buddy you people in polk county know better You've been living under a rock or what? Ladies and gentlemen, in Polk County vernacular, this lady's a nut. Wake up, America. Welcome to Florida on vacation. You're going to leave on probation. A pregnant Lakeland woman is wanted for criminal charges after a 10-minute temper tantrum at a McDonald's. Sheriff Grady Judd says after she became enraged with the amount of time her order was taking, she stormed behind the counter and made a mess. Justin Shecker is live at that McDonald's in Lakeland to show us video of the outburst. Justin. Josh and Stacy, good afternoon to you both. This major McMeltdown happened at this McDonald's yesterday evening. The suspect has been identified as 22-year-old Tianis Jones. Let's have Sheriff Grady Judd explain in his own words why deputies want to book her in the county jail. This is going to be Mick interesting. Look right here. She's a pretty lady, but she was Mick mad. There was no calming her down. She was in a Mick rage. I don't know if she was like two fries short of a Happy Meal, or maybe it was she was short of the Happy Meal completely. But she created a McMess, and she acted like a McNutt. But you know what she ended up? A McBurglar. She didn't get her Happy Meal, or her fish sandwich, or her chocolate shake, or her sweet tea, but she managed to get herself into a lot of McTrouble. And we're not going to give her any golden arches, but we are going to give her a pair of silver handcuffs. And you can make money just by helping us find this lady who went Mick crazy for no Mick reason. And there's one thing that you need to understand in Polk County. We don't put up with that Mick junk. Surprise. Welcome to Polk County. Oh, wow. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Somebody better give me a lock on this video. Look at everybody. Everybody don't jump. Don't jump at the same time now. Hey, Savannah. At least I got one watcher in here, right? Oh, yeah. 
So if we look right here. Look at that. Does that say... Does that say Sheriff Brady? Oh, wow. You see, now, let me just say this right here. One thing that Sheriff Brady does better than anyone else is his heart to put away child predators. Sheriff Grady, the world's greatest sheriff. I'm gonna tell you right now, I look up to Sheriff Grady. I mean, really, I mean, I've always, I, I love to just pick his brain on tactics that he uses. So now you know where a lot of my tactics and things come from. Especially uh, the connections with one more child. The sheriff's department works with them a lot. One more child actually helps children with human trafficking and kind of takes them in and kind of gives them a little bit of a rehabilitation for victims of human trafficking. So, uh, but here's the thing about it. If you ever want a safe bet, if you ever want a safe bet, I'm telling you right now, on an election, never, ever, ever vote against Sheriff Grady because he's going to be there for as long as he wants to be there. That is a fact. His, his, uh, put it this way, his nomination's always sealed. His election's sealed when it comes to Sheriff Grady. And who, who don't know what, who don't know who Sheriff Grady is, guys? Let me get this live chat. Thank you, thank you. I told you we was getting ready to go do some stuff. We're going to do some cool stuff. But who don't know who Sheriff Grady is? Raise your hand if you don't know who Sheriff Grady is. Sheriff Grady. Okay, now there's many sections down here for the for the different section departments. Like there's court, there's like the sheriff's office, there's a training center down here. But that just shows you, you know, it's not like an ordinary sheriff's department. No, uh -uh. I was talking to his secretary, and yeah, I know who his secretary is. And she was telling me like, oh my god, you know, to get a meeting with Sheriff Brady, it's like, good god, I mean, it's like. You have to call in seven, eight months in advance to do this. You can't just mosey in and meet the man. I mean, you just, unless you know him. You ain't going to just mosey in and meet him. I mean, even his family has to make appointments. But uh, this man's great at what he does, especially when the automated, when you call or anything, the automated voice alone is about child predators. That right there shows the man and the man what the man's on a mission. You can't beat that. And you, you know, like I said, his his election's always sealed. I mean, if you want to, if people are betting on someone to win, I put my money up on Sheriff Grady any day. I love watching. I love love watching how he does his demonstrations. I love how he brings it to the table. He brings it clearly. His thought process is so in sync. He knows what he's doing. Beautiful down here. Lord, it's beautiful. Now, who called who? <laughs> Judd Grady. I'm telling you. What a sight. So, everybody, I want you all to give a one. Number one. Give me in the chat here. Number one for Sheriff Grady. And we're going to give a number one for one more child. One more child is one of the biggest uh, operations that. Uh, affiliations down here that they work with so everybody give a one thank you thank you appreciate it thank you i appreciate it now because this video is pertaining to what it pertains to i'm not going to put the donation thing up because i think that this pertains to so much more than just a cash app or a paypal or anything of like that we have to be legit in what we do in everything we do actually we have to be legit 
And if we're not legit, we're not nobody, we're nothing. That's just the way I believe. So, with that being said, we got operations in other places than that, so, and I want to see those flourish. I hate this damn thing. So, oh yeah, thank you. All you guys, thank you, thank you, I appreciate it. Appreciate it. It means a lot. I mean, you, you guys mean a lot. I mean, I'm, I'm going to be honest with you. You guys mean a lot. I couldn't go and do this stuff. I couldn't pack my shit like this and go in, around the country doing this stuff without you guys. I couldn't. And I just wanted to be blessed and do travels. Sometimes it's, I ain't going to lie, it's, it's hard, guys. It's hard. It's really, really hard sometimes. But we got to do what we got to do. We got to always fight that fight. We got to fight that battle. We got to do it. Oh, let's see here. Hitting. Hopefully we can get us a good little team together, get some stuff running for tonight, and check it out. I've, I've got everything charged, everything's ready. You know, these operations, you know, they, they can take hours and hours and hours, but the actual action in it's like 10, 12 minutes, and it's over, you know. When we bust these predators, it's 12 minutes tops, 13 maybe. But it's, you know, we gotta, we gotta always do it in the right direction and put it the right way. That's the big thing about it. Let me get my hat. Oh God, it's hot down here. I ain't gonna lie, I'm gonna gear up. I need a partner in crime. Are there any single ladies that would just like a nice guy? I mean, really? Well, I had to show this to show the non-believers that I was down here in Polk County, Florida and getting things done. So uh, I hope that takes care of the, the misunderstanding and the misconfigurations and stuff. Who is that? Who is that? Who would you like to see taken down? I know a certain person, a certain someone in Florida, I love to see taken down. Who is that, Candace Hardwick? Who are we talking about? Who's that certain person? Do I know him? Oh, who is it? I want to know. If you want to email PredatorHunterNation at gmail.com, and if you, you know, look, ladies, uh, we get thousands and thousands of messages, literally. But if you want to, you want us to help you, we can help you. We can put you in the right sources. That's a fact. But we got to have you, you know, to bring, come forward first, to come forward with it. Oh Lord of mercy, what a day. I gotta eat I gotta eat again. Are there any nice ladies down here that's real nice cooks? Oh Lord. Massage therapist, anything like that. Oh god. Yeah, it's broke. Oh god. Oh my god. But anyways, much respect guys. God bless you all. And some of these ladies out here, I shake my head at. I've been shaking my head at my whole body at. Look, see? Have fun guys. Much respect. God bless. If you want to donate, donate. If you don't, don't. Good God Almighty. It's the craziest thing I've seen. We arrested you on your birthday. Just consider it our present. You gagged me with a drop of light. It's hot. News flash. We were watching. We got your gold. We put your tail in the gang. got your gold. We put your tail in the county jail. Thank y'all for being here and listening to my rant today. I'm hot about all this, if you can't tell. Oh, Lord of mercy, what a day. I gotta eat, I gotta eat again. Are there any nice ladies down here that's real nice cooks? Massage therapist, anything like that. Oh God, <laughs> yeah, it's broke. Oh God. Oh my God. But anyways, much respect, guys. God bless you all. And some of these ladies out here, I shake my head at. I've been shaking my head at and my whole body at. Look, see? Have fun, guys. Much respect. God bless.
Come on, man. Are you nuts? Brady Judd is sher sheriff is known for going after suspects with a vengeance. Well, tonight the tables have turned. An attorney for the woman right there who was arrested after she tore up a Lakeland McDonald's is calling him out. Fox 13's Ken Suarez is live at the restaurant on Memorial Boulevard. That's where this whole thing began. So what's going on and what can you tell us? Well, let's start with a refresher course. A week ago tonight, I stood right here and told you how the lady basically created all kinds of havoc at the McDonald's right back there when they messed up her order. Bottom line is that the sheriff, in no uncertain terms, called her out and pointed the finger directly at her. Now her attorney is pointing it right back at him. If that just doesn't rip the button off your shirt, I don't know what the... Me. 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 No. Well, she doesn't give a rat's patoot about a rat's patoot about you. Did I tell you that? No, you can't say it for you because obviously. News flash, here's the cold hard facts. What? We lined up with three women in my bed last night. I mean, with three women in bed last night. What the I mean, heck is wrong with you? Well, guess what? Mama's got to be proud. Here, Einstein, let me give you a news flash. News flash? Bang, bang. Bar, bar. I, bar, I, say bar. I don't bang, know. Bang. I, I, I give up. Three women in my bed last night. I mean, was that just like the energizer bunnies? It was travel or the other hotel. Come on, man. guys, I just give up. I mean, you may be yawned in a nut. That's not damn. Oh my god, I'm getting dizzy. I've been taking my head out the whole body. I'm going to die. I don't know what you're saying. You're just idiots.